small town and the district capital of the upper Manyakrobo district in Ghana's eastern region. It is about 45 kilometers from the regional capital, Kufudia. This town is very popular because of the Asasawa market, but the road network to the town is not in the best of shapes. In the early 90s, the Asasawa market could have been said to be the biggest market in Ghana, and until date, it is still relevant to the country's food basket. It is a historic trading post with a mix of cultures from all over Ghana. Mondays and Fridays are market days at the Asasawa market. However, a handful of the traders sell their items at the market daily using different sizes of umbrellas as shade. A typical Friday at the Asasawa market is a very full day. Music and product advertisements blaring loudly from speakers placed on cars and vantage areas in the market. Sellers and buyers haggling over the prices of food items. Truck pushers, headquarters popularly known as Kayaye, hawkers, pushing and shoving shoppers. Drivers honking loudly and Okada riders crisscrossing both cars and humans create a clamorous din. Hundreds of traders from farming communities, including Bripo Munya, Akatin, Tisiaman, Okrantumi, and Kofurbia, who flood the market, bring along large quantities of fresh and processed food items to sell for cheap, making the market a one stop wholesale point for affordable farm produce. Cheap is good for many, so it attracts buyers from across the country. Quite a handful of traders who are the regular market women display their wares on tabletops, while the majority who throng the market on the market days display the items on the bare ground under the scorching sun with some carrying their babies on their backs. There is abundance of food items such as cassava, plantain, maize, tubers of yams, cocoa yams, garden eggs, and kondo, and livestock. Sadly, this popular market lacks basic amenities such as access to flowing water. The poor sanitary conditions at the market is also of great concern. Business is slow nowadays. It is my wish we get more buyers so we can cater for ourselves and families and also pay our taxes. In the past, the spacious Asasawa market was endowed with some concrete stalls that enhanced trading there. Those were mainly occupied by dressmakers, hairdressers, and some market women. Currently, most of the stalls have been abandoned and left to deteriorate. We don't make good sales these days because a lot of people who visit the market do not buy anything. Just as it was in the past, traders here still practice the butter trade. We still practice butter trade here. For instance, if someone brings me fish, I will give the person cassava dough, which I sell in exchange. At present, the entire market is unpaid, and the overwhelming huge crowd at the market seems to be compounding the dusty condition of the facility. So you call Kakutre, TBC News, Asesewa, Eastern Region.